What's up everybody, Corey Limitless Power Sports here, back with another video. This time we're in Oklahoma at Little Sahara, and we went out, uh, one of my good customers and friends invited me, and you can see that we had a heck of a time. The lineup's looking pretty good. We got Banshees, uh, I see LT500 over there. Uh, we had a couple YFZs, built Honda, um, and then Jason had pretty much any 250 you can think of. Some big bores, some three-wheelers, um, and then one really nasty 390 that I think everybody took a turn on, and that thing, it would it would put you in your seat. So I went out there not really knowing what to expect, just thinking we we're going to go play in the sand, but honestly, the 250R event as a whole, uh, I think it's on my list as an annual trip now, so looking forward to it. So this is my uh, my 22nd crash course in how to ride in the sand. So I'm leaning into the turn here, and you can tell, oh, don't do that, almost ran off. I'm trying to check the grip. So for these tires, it took me about uh, 10 seconds, 15 seconds, to learn that it kind of drives like a fast jet ski. You gotta kind of watch your front end angle, or else it digs in. And other than that, push on the, the outside peg so it'll hook and come around. And after that, we're ready to go. So right here you can hear it kind of bogging down and that, at that point I realized it's running pretty fat. Uh, so luckily one of the 250 guys had a screwdriver in their bag so I was able to just change some vortex settings. Um, I dropped it from 666 to 655 and that's what I ended up running the rest of the weekend and that's uh, on map 9. weekend the YFZ had some complaints riding behind it that uh, it, it throws quite the rooster tail so I didn't know what they were talking about until after this clip.
sunrise ride. My confidence is through the roof in the sand. This next hill, I'm thinking, all right, we're hauling. We're all three gonna clear this thing, get about three or four foot of air, laying flat. And I'm paying too much attention to what Jason's doing. And I was like, oh, he's gonna hit it. So I'm gonna follow him. And I saw right at the top, he kind of slowed down. I was like, oh, maybe there's something I don't see. And then I have fucked up. <laughs> See you next week. <laughs> I really wanted to jump it and I was like, oh, I'm gonna slow down right at the lip. And then sure enough, skid plate. No, no, no. And then... Don't stop at the lip. Okay. Like that. I wanted to hit that. I wanted to hit it harder. <laughs> Last year, anything polished was not polished when I got home. You're 100 yards behind. You see anybody that fucks up, you, got, you know what the awareness is, huh? <laughs> So that's going to do it for the 250R event. Can't wait for the next one. Uh, possibly going to the Glamis one in February. I heard that it's like 10 times the size. But yeah, if you're close to Oklahoma, this is a cannot miss. And if you're not close, there's some people that drove plus 20 plus hours to get there. So definitely check it out next year.